and bags of flour, and you got flour on you, you were dead. Yep. You know, mm. that's the way of yeah. invasion work. In other words, you stay out of the way and you mm. take cover. Yeah. You know, but I'll tell you, it was a day like today, except it was probably 65, 70 degrees, mm. and beautiful weather. And, but I'll tell you what, then we came back, we were back maybe three or four days. The next thing you know, we got orders, we're moving out. Mm. You figure out, now this was in May. Mm -hmm. That was in May. Yeah. The invasion started June 4th, if you remember right. Yep, yep. All right. We come back, I was in Avonmouth Docks in England, mm -hmm. which is on the channel. Mm -hmm. And there was thousands and thousands and thousands of soldiers there. Mm -hmm. We're just one little bitty group. Mm -hmm. But we were a very important group yeah. because we had to be in charge of supplies. Mm -hmm. Or the master come out and get it, mm -hmm. but we had to be in charge of all the supplies. Set our commanding officer on shore, who didn't leave the beachhead. Mm -hmm. He hit the beachhead third wave. He dug in and he stayed. Mm -hmm. Him and two of his other officers, mm -hmm. they stayed. Wow. He didn't go out and duck anything. Mm -hmm. They stayed. And I'll tell you something: the Germans weren't any further. Maybe two or three streets away, firing back. Really? Wow! But right away we. They, first thing when we hit the beachhead, we come in an LCIL, Landing Craft Infantry Large. They drop that gate down, you head for the beach. Mm. But the 29th Infantry Division, mm -hmm. the guys that I knew in the stockade, mm -hmm. were the first ones to hit the beachhead. Really? On Omaha Beach. Mm. 12,000 men. Yeah. Of that 12,000 men, 80% was either wounded or wiped out. 12,000 men, yeah. that's only one division. Mm -hmm. That ain't counted the Army Rangers, the Navy Seabees, the different other branches of service. Mm -hmm. There was so much going on that it would boggle your mind and that, see that red box up there? Mm -hmm. And you're as scared as that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't let no one ever tell you that he went into battle and he wasn't scared. Yeah unless you're a heathenistic thing and you're there to kill everything you can kill yeah. because it's in you to kill yeah. you know mm -hmm. uh, there are people like that Brent. Mm -hmm. oh yeah there are people like that believe me and but i'll tell you something i seen things that i never want to see again mm -hmm. i never want to see loading a hospital ship yeah. i loaded two of them mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's still in my mind 20, 30, 40 men in uniform that have to tap them on the shoulder to move. Mm. Their brain's completely gone. Mm. They're alive, yeah. they're healthy, but they're a zombie. Because of what they saw? No, because of shells that exploded oh, the and shot. blew the mind out. And another thing too, some things probably what they saw because they came from a battlefield, yeah. you know. Mm. But I'll tell you something. You know, I'll tell you something, uh, what you see and what I've seen in military, I never want to see again. Never. Mm -hmm. But I learned about death. Yeah. 